We made it. Summer's officially over. This summer, we've hosted two of our biggest events in our annual calendar. But with two left to come, we promised to finish 2022 with a bang. Leadville was another huge success, with six of our mountain bikers finishing the 100-mile challenge and four of them achieving their big buckles. We headed back to Leadville for a second time this summer for the trail run. Three of our runners lasted the challenge, reaching the finish line in under 30 hours. Leadville is not only a big fundraiser for CKF, but also allows us to reach over 4,000 individuals. Wine and Dine was a phenomenal evening, with attendees enjoying fabulous food, wonderful wine, and incredible music. We also honored three of our bounce back winners from 2020, 2021, and 2022, as they accepted their awards. Events like Wine and Dine help us to continue our mission to eliminate the wait for a transplant. We would like to officially announce that we have hired a new executive director, Jesse Rochelle. We are thrilled to have Jesse joining the CKF team in October. Jesse's father received a heart transplant over six years ago, and she has become a strong advocate for organ, eye, and tissue donation since then. Kids are back in school, and we're excited to get back to spreading the message of organ, eye, and tissue donation in schools across the country. If you'd like to get involved and help us raise awareness in your area, we have two options for you. Our newly rebooted toolkits are perfect for teachers looking to educate an entire class or individuals looking to learn more. We also help individuals raise awareness through our Donor Dudes events. You can host your own event in your school, workplace, or community. And CKF will assist by sending swag and educational materials to help you help others understand the importance of organ donation. Our events are not over with our team of 12 heading to the Big Apple in November to help raise awareness for donation. These, this event helps us reach thousands across the country, and if you'd like to show your support for our team, you can learn more in our newsletter. We will be finishing the year with our everlasting Summit for Life. Registration is open, and you can sign up today to head up the mountain with us on December 3rd. If you cannot join us in person, we do have a virtual option if you fancy a winter challenge. Entry for our in-person race is $50 with a fundraising minimum of 100 though we encourage all of our participants to go above and beyond this. You can learn more about any of our events and programs I have just mentioned by scrolling down in the newsletter or heading to our website. We hope you have a fabulous fall.